If you have been diagnosed with a 15 millimeter cystic lesion within the right lobe of the liver, adjacent to the gallbladder, but with no continuity with the gallbladder lumen, it's important to understand the possible differential diagnoses. The first possibility is a simple hepatic cyst, which is a benign fluid-filled cyst within the liver that is typically asymptomatic and appears as a well-defined anechoic structure without internal vascularity or septations on an ultrasound. Another possibility is a biliary hamatoma, von Meinberg complex, side which are benign malformations of the bile ducts that can appear as small cystic lesions within the liver. They are usually asymptomatic. Intrahepatic biliary cystadenoma is a rare benign tumor of the bile ducts that can appear as a cystic lesion. These cysts can have internal septations, but in smaller sizes or early stages, they might appear as simple cysts, cold occult cysts, specifically type the three or type V Caroli disease to a congenital anomalies that involve dilatation of the intrahepatic bile ducts. While they are most commonly associated with the bile ducts, they can also present as cystic lesions within the liver. Hydatid cysts caused by echinococcus granulosus can present as a simple cyst in its early stage, but usually progress to a more complex cyst with septations or daughter cysts, making it less likely in this case. Perabiliary cysts are typically located along the bile ducts and can be adjacent to the gallbladder and are more common in patients with cirrhosis or portal hypertension. The most likely diagnosis in this case remains a simple hepatic cyst due to its benign nature and typical appearance on ultrasound. However, it's important to consider the possibility of a cholidocol cyst, particularly if there is any suspicion of a congenital anomaly involving the biliary system. Further imaging, such as MRCP, may be necessary to definitively characterize the lesion and its relation to the biliary system. Although the absence of continuity with the gallbladder lumen slightly reduces the likelihood of a cholidocal cyst involving the extrahepatic bile ducts, it does not fully exclude this possibility.